Hello and welcome, my name is Alex and this is TechFlow. So if you've been a long time subscriber on the channel, you'll definitely know that I love smart home tech. We've done countless videos of it in the past. I've shown you guys how I secure my house, how I lock my house, how I play music and control the lights in my house. Heck, pretty much everything, all the way to the garden lights being smart. Everything is smart in my house except one thing and that one thing is heating. Now my house is a new build. It was built no longer than a year and a half ago and they installed a smart heating system, well that's what they called it, in my house with the use of the Hive heating system. And this has little wireless things, one upstairs, one downstairs. But the problem is these kept disconnecting and I just didn't find them all that useful as to when I was gonna be wanting heat on and off. Now if you asked any 22 year old, including me, can you go and order me a boiler? I'm pretty sure they wouldn't really know where to begin. And that's where Box are trying to make a difference here. On their website it says Boxed has revolutionized the UK heating industry with the disruptive power of digital. So I'm going to go ahead and order my boiler right here for installation on this iPad right now. What type of fuel does your boiler use? Well mine uses gas. Then it's saying what type of boiler do I currently have? Well I've got a, a standard one. Now it's asking me do I want a combi boiler? Now I do, that's gonna be much more energy efficient for me, so I'm gonna click yes. It'll ask where the current boiler is, it's in the airing cupboard. And now they're asking me if I want the boiler relocated, no. Now it's simply asking me what type of house I have. I've got a detached house, now how many bedrooms? I've got four bedrooms in mine. How many bathtubs? I've got one bathtub in my house. Do any of your bathtubs have showers in them? Yes, they do. And then I also have a separate shower. Wow, this is actually mental. So now it's asking for the type of roof. I've got a sloped roof on my house and it's in the two highest thirds is where my current flue is. Now I need to enter the first four digits of my postcode so Boxed can find a local installer around my area to come and install my new boiler and all the smart equipment to go along with it. Click view products. There you go, just after answering a few simple questions, as you can see here, I can choose any which boiler I would want to fit my current needs for my house and then uh, we're pretty much good to go. I love this, so it says what's in the box here. Right, so if we click on boiler, obviously we're gonna get the boiler, it gives you all the measurements of it and everything. But then it says here, Nest Learning Thermostat and stand for the Google Home Mini. So you get a Google Home Mini and the learning thermostat to go along with it. So you can control your heating when you're out and about or with your voice, which is the most exciting thing. And there we go, it's literally as easy as that. I've ordered my boiler, all that's left to do now is choose the install date down here. As you can see, we're now on the 18th. The next one I can choose is the 22nd, so we will book that in there. It says here your installer will arrive between 7.30 and 9.30 a.m. That's absolutely brilliant. Right, I need to get myself off to the shops and get some coffees. Upstairs, as you can imagine. Yeah, I've got a little dog, so he'll go a bit mental for a bit, but he's all right. <laughs> Drinks wise, guys, coffee, uh, tea, sugars. Uh, tea with three, please. Tea with three, I saw that on the thing, yeah. Tea with three, yeah. 
I'll have a coffee with half. Coffee at half? Tea with two. Tea with two, lovely. So a couple of days ago, I waved bye to both Pete and Morgan. They were absolutely amazing throughout the entire install of my brand new boiler and nest system. I'm gonna walk you guys through the majority of it right now, whilst I go ahead and actually install uh, the nest thermostat where the old hive thermostat used to be on the wall here. Now this is super, super dope, super awesome smart tech. This is the Nest Learning Thermostat, and I'm gonna be talking a lot about this more towards the end of the video. But for now, I'm gonna get it mounted up on the wall. It's currently on its little desk stand. And whilst I'm doing that, I'll talk about the installation with Boxed and how all of that went. But the installation with Boxed was, like they said, really 21st century. It took us, well, as you saw at the start of the video, a couple minutes to get the actual boiler ordered, choose an installation date, and then they were round. Pete was absolutely awesome, and so was Morgan. They completely covered up all of my stairs so they didn't make any mess, and the whole thing was just super, super nice. I even got an email before they actually came, and it said, hello, my name's Pete. I like tea, and I like Jaffa cakes. So that's what I went out to buy him when he came to install. <laughs> So after the order process was complete the other day, I got this email through and it said, meet your installer, Pete. This is how I knew what was gonna be going on. It said he likes tea with three sugars and jammy dodgers. And then this is good to know as well, when the installation was complete, when the boys left me the other day, I got this email saying, hi Alexander, that's right, we'll now cover you for 10 years with an automatic guarantee activated for the boiler. Just nice peace of mind things. So the hive system that I had installed last time, yeah, I had loads of problems with it. The downstairs zone essentially wasn't even connecting. So as you can see, we've taken the plate off here for that. And this one, oh no way, it fits over absolutely perfect. This is gonna look so dope when it's mounted on the wall. So luckily enough, this house was designed with this really pointless cupboard uh, literally downstairs. So I've got all this room in here to just have as much mess and cable as I want. And we can close that away and it's never ever to be seen again. And our nest is now mounted on the wall. <laughs> well, now it is, there we go. I also love the fact that it has a little level built into the unit so you can just make sure that ah, this is going to look so good. So this is the wall plate here. It goes onto the back of the stand mount or you can obviously mount it onto the wall. The micro USB cable just plugs into the back like that. That is so cool. So now essentially with all the uh, shininess of the video out the way, we have this mounted on the wall. I'll put some B-roll footage over right now of this whilst all of this is patched up because without this, it's just gonna look absolutely awesome. So how is this smart and how does this, other than making a cool tiny little tick noise and having a nice display on it and having proximity sensors in it when you come down the stairs, the screen lights up, how does it actually be smart and link to your phone? Box said to me that uh, they could take this away for me or I could keep it. Now I just said I may as well keep it because why not? I have my spare boiler if I, if I ever need one or if any of you wanna take it off me, come and grab it because I've got a new one now. So we'll go and check that out. This 
is the new Worcester boiler that has been replaced with my old one. But Pete was super helpful throughout, like I said, the whole situation when he finished as well, he showed me how to use the boiler and also to the best of his and my knowledge, how to use the brand new Nest heating system, which I'm still learning and I think I'm pretty much almost there. But before this boiler was installed, I actually had two of these hive units sat here. Now you can see I've only got one of them. Now I'll throw some B-roll footage over now. One of these hide units actually had a white light on it, which meant it was broken and not working. So they've replaced that with the Nest one. I've got Hive up here and the Nest downstairs. And I can tell you that the Nest is just so much better. And this is the box and this lets you connect the unit downstairs, the wireless sort of thermostat, if you like, to the boiler. So when you make a change on the thermostat, it sends it to this and the boiler knows what the hell to do. And there we go, it's now all magic. It's all set up via the thermostat that is now on the wall. Essentially, you connect that to the Wi-Fi and the lovely chap from Boxed did all of that with me. We were literally right there when it happened. And now it's all linked to my Nest account. So what you can actually do once it's linked to your Nest account is swipe down on the Nest Hub, go over to thermostats, and then it's gonna pipe into the thermostat that we've got. It says the temperature is currently 22 degrees and it's currently set to 19. We can go ahead and turn up the temp if we'd like to, or turn it down, or change the mode. I want eco for now. So when I was actually getting my demo from Pete about how to use the Nest thermostat, he was 100% correct when he said that the thermostat itself looks and is awesome, but you will get the most control out of the app on your iPad or iPhone or just your phone, any type of phone that has the app on it. So this is the Nest application. As you can see, I've got my front door there and then it says downstairs, the thermostat's currently set to eco. So if I tap into there, I can go ahead and change my settings. If I stop eco, it says the heat is set to 20.5 and it's currently 22 degrees in here right now we can go ahead and turn it down nice little audible click on there as you do this but this is where it gets cool you go into schedule and you can actually every single day go and change what time it is and what temperature you want it to be at that current time so as you can see I have it set here for 8 o'clock every morning it sets the heat to 21 degrees so by the time I come down and it's 9 o'clock it's nice and toasty downstairs I think that is invaluable and whilst it's invaluable it's also saving you money because you don't have to have your heating running throughout the night so your house is hot in the morning this is so cool, like I absolutely love this stuff. Bringing smart into heating, also saving you money, like that is a win-win. And also the entire process, ordering and having it installed with Boxed was absolutely awesome. Just five minutes, tap, 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 ordered, and then they came round, didn't make any mess in my house, and they've just left me with this awesome Nest stuff. Honestly, I couldn't be happier. This is awesome. So these are more of the granular settings of the Nest Learning Thermostat in the back end of it, essentially. This is one of my favorite features. It's called the safety temperature. Now with this colder weather that we've got coming into winter, it's not gonna let the temperature in this house drop below six degrees so that my pipes, hopefully, well, fingers crossed, won't freeze. You can go ahead and turn on things like true radiant and time to temp, and it can also auto schedule temperatures to know when you're leaving your house or when you're back using geofencing. And now this is cool. You can click history and see throughout the days who's been messing with your thermostat. So on Thursday the 14th, look at that, eight and a half hours my heating was on for. That's mental, must've been a cold day. This, this is heating in the 21st century and I love it. So if you've been a long time subscriber of the channel, you'll know that it's literally my mission to try and find the best smart home gadgets and what's best and what works and what doesn't and then turn this camera on and hopefully tell you guys my findings. So that was why it was really important for me today to work with Boxed on their entire installation about bringing boilers to the 21st century, how easy the process was to get the thing ordered and installed and then the Nest Learning Thermostat just as amazing with all of its smart features. But like I say, I've only had it for a couple of days. Hopefully I'll find out a little bit more and then I'll do a full smart home tour for you guys with everything in my house that's smart. So stay tuned for that. But thanks Box for sponsoring this video and we'll see you in the next one. Adios.